Hey guys, in this video I'm just going to be practicing a memory exam with you and I just need you to follow my instructions and stay relaxed, don't get stressed out and I hope you guys enjoy. So the first test, I'm just going to be giving you a series of words and I just need you to repeat them back to me in the opposite direction. So for example, if I were to say red, apple, June, you would say June, apple, red. Okay, ready? Okay, here we go. Alright, my pen ready. Okay, are you ready? Okay, let's begin. Coffee, chair, apple. Good, good. Right, ready for the next one? Okay. Bread, sock, ring. Perfect, perfect. Okay, ready for the next one? Okay, right. Milk, shoe, pencil. Right, and the last one is going to be juice, cup, tissue. Okay, I'll repeat it one more time. Juice, cup, tissue. Good, good. Alright, so for the next set, I'm just going to be doing numbers this time. So hopefully it's a bit easier, um, but it's going to be four sets of numbers instead of three like before. So just do the same thing, just repeat it back to me in the opposite direction. Okay, great. You ready? Okay. Four, six, nine, one. Ready? Okay. Three, ten, seven, five. Let's repeat those back. Perfect. Okay, nine, twelve, six, four. Okay, great. Twenty. 16, 11, 2. Okay. Great. That wasn't so hard, was it? <laughs> Great. Okay. That's the second test. Just write a couple of notes down real quick. Okay, so now we're just gonna test common memory, as in to see if you can understand the logic behind these certain objects. Yes, so it's, it's a different test, um, still a memory test, but it's, it's solely just for your common sense memory, so to say. But pretty much, I'm just gonna be giving you a series of three words or things and you just have to tell me what they all have in common okay simple yeah okay right are you ready okay orange banana apple fruits exactly good job are you ready for the next set we have red, blue, green. Colors, good. 
Right, you ready for the next? Okay. This one's a bit more trickier. Just a little bit, just heads up. Eggs, bacon, toast. Good breakfast items. Great. And the last one should be pretty easy. Yeah. Okay, we have ocean, lake, sea. Water, exactly. Okay, that's it for the third test. I'm gonna move on to the fourth test. Alright, so what I need you to do for me is just to tap your finger on the desk. Yes. Um, so I want you to tap that. Oh, yeah, so show me making sure you could tap your finger of course <laughs> okay that's good so all you need to do is tap your finger one time on the desk whenever you hear me list the letter a so I'm just gonna be giving you different letters in the alphabet and you just have to tap when you hear the letter a okay are you ready I won't go too fast it'll be pretty pretty slow for you okay Ready? B, J, A, C, D, A, V, A, U, X, Y, D, A, A, W, A, Z, Y, H, A. Good job. Great. You did very, very good on that one. Hope I wasn't going too fast. <laughs> Write a couple notes down. Alright, so I'm going to do the same thing, but with numbers this time. And the number you'll have to tap for is the number one. Okay, ready? Four, seven, six, one, three, one, five, nine, one, one, two, one, two, three, eight, four, one, six, seven, one. Great, good job. You kind of slipped up a little bit there. <laughs> Almost. Yeah, Yeah, you know, the, the more we do these kinds of tests all the time, it gets very repetitive. People usually think it's super easy, but sometimes, you know, you're human. Okay. And the last test that we're going to be doing is the sentence test. And pretty much I'm just going to be reading a sentence to you, and I just need you to repeat that sentence back. Yeah, it won't be too long, long of a sentence, just seven to eight words. Yes. Okay, so you're going to be giving four sentences. So are you ready for the first one? Great. Okay. The boy in red likes to sing. Good job. Right, ready for the next one. Right. The chef made eggs for his wife. Okay, great. Good job. Alright, ready for the next one? Okay. The bridge was built before the winter. Good job. In the last sentence, the clock was set on the wrong hands. Good, good job. That was simple enough. <laughs> Alright, and the last test is just a visual memory. So I'm just going to be holding up individual playing cards and 
pretty much just need you to tell me what suit and what number you see on the card. So how this will be conducted is just me holding it up for a good two seconds, holding it back down for you to not see anymore, and you just have to visually remember and recollect what the suit and number. So for this card, it's going to be the number seven, and the suit is hearts. Okay, so I just need you to give me those two answers, simple enough. All right. Are you ready? Okay. Here goes the first card. Okay, what was the suit and number? Four spades. Great. Thank you. Okay, you ready for the next one? Okay. Suit and number? Good. Great job. Alright, so now I'm just going to keep a steady flow going so no interruptions um, so just give it to me as fast as you can <laughs> okay ready good 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 So that concludes our test. Thank you for joining.